In this video, I'm going to be tying the simple one. This is uh, the final fly in the Pfeiffer collection and was created by Mr. Pfeiffer himself. Uh, in the vise, I have a Daiki 1710 size 6. That's a 2x long hook. Uh, tie it in size 6 for American Shad or uh, 8s for Hickories. I am going to be tying this fly with some Danville's red flat wax nylon. And I'll go ahead and lay down a base of thread starting oh, about a hook eye behind the hook eye. Hook eye's length behind the hook eye. And uh, bring my thread down to the barb. Snip away the excess thread. Uh, for the body, I'm going to be using some silver, silver mylar tubing. I already got this cut to length. I'm going to tie it in at the butt of the fly, but I want to leave a section long enough to take it back up to our tie in point. Let's capture that with our thread. And I'm actually going to take the thread back down and up again and make some tight wraps here. And it'll just keep the mylar tube or tubing from spinning on you. Now I'm just going to go ahead and wrap her body. And I like to kind of overlap my wraps and pull tight. It'll flatten down that tubing. Let's take your time. I generally take this right up just about to the eye and then capture. And that way it doesn't have a tendency to unwind. Some good tight wraps there. And then snip away the excess. And just to protect the body, I'm going to touch it with some Sally Hansons. And we'll let that dry. Okay, our body is dry. I have a nice, shiny, strong body. I've gone ahead and brought my thread back about uh, two eye lengths back from the eye. For the wing, we're going to be using some white kip tail, and you want something uh, decent uh, length. And you want a pretty good sized clump of this. Something about like that. Just going to cut a section out. And I'm going to pull out the fluff, but unlike uh, most of the time when I'm tying kip tail, uh, time with kip tail, I'm not going to grab it by the tips and pull out any of the shorter uh, hairs. What we want to do is instead of just stacking this on the uh, on the on the top of the fly, <clears throat> we actually want to let it roll around the hook shank and then capture. Go ahead and advance our thread some. 
and then I'm just going to cut away all the excess. Looks like I may have snagged my thread, so I'm just going to make a couple of extra safety wraps there. Continue to snip away the excess. It's pretty good. So then I'll just build up the rest of the head here. I like a pretty good size head on this fly. I think it looks nice. And then I'll whip finish. To finish the fly, I'm just going to touch the head with some Sally Hansen's. And that is Pfeiffer's The Simple One.